There is nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium, especially when there's so much on the line. The build-up has been intense, and now we just can't wait for us all to begin. It's anyone's guess, though, which team will come out on top in front of a packed house. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you from Manchester here on EA TV Live. Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Manchester United, and they take on Sheffield United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Oh, might be. Rashford! Oh, that's a fine save. <laughs> and there's the delivery. Well, a nearly moment, you've got to say. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, four goals in his last three appearances says it all, doesn't it, Derek? He's been absolutely outstanding. He's taken the chances that come his way, and he looks a real threat every time he gets the ball. Oh, it's developing nicely for them here. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Raritan. In a decent position now. Well, very effective play in possession. be a favourable situation this for Manchester United spot on with that tackle Brereton United might be able to cash in takes aim and the post getting in the way well nothing untoward happened and the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Well, had that gone in, they would be in complete control of this game. As it is, they're still going to be a bit nervy. Well, they have to have that sense of self-belief. It could happen for them. He knew he had to make the tackle, and did. <laughs> Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Bogle. Brereton. It did look on for them, but not to be. And he's through here. Oliver Norwood. Jaden Bogle. Moving the ball forwards, how creative can they be? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Oh, in with a chance! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Playing it in, not the best clearance. And a fine stop.
Rashford. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Jaden Bogle. And as a play it goes, throw in coming up here. Well, the stats tell you everything. They've lacked invention, they've lacked creativity, and they haven't got the ball into the penalty area often enough. And that's why they're behind in this game. Well, in possession now. Let's see what they can create. Perfect challenge. And he's broken free. Well, in position to finish off the chance, but couldn't do so. Well, what can I say? That should have been a goal. It's a big miss, really. Here's a change for Manchester United. Oliver Norwood. Jaden Bogle. Very quick thinking there. So nearing the break, and it's United on top. Stuart, how about your critique of their first half display? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? And he'll take no further part in this game. That could make things interesting, Stuart. Well, I can't believe he's done that. They were coasting here. It's going to make it difficult now. Gustavo Hamer. In possession, Ahmed Hodzic. Oliver McBurney. And totaling up all the stoppages. We'll have two. This could square the game. Well, straight at the goalkeeper then. And he's won the ball. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. I think... Mo well, they've got things going again here. And I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Hamer. High quality defending. Feeding it through. And through for the goal kick. He hits it with power. Bruno Fernandes has it. On to Juan Bissaka. Marcus Rashford. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Oh, what an opportunity. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Oh, a goal! And an own goal at that. Well, not part of the script, was it? Well, as the replay shows us, that will be classed as an own goal. He's a bit unlucky there. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Determined defending. Oliver Norwood. Now McBurney. This looks interesting. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. And they will make the change now. High pressing at its best. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in.
Marcus Rashford. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Gustavo Hammer. Now McBurney. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Not a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. The supporters want to see him have a go. And there is the goal to give them the lead with 10 men. Well, as you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Oliver Norwood. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Can you please remain seated after the game? And your coach. Just the challenge that was required. Thank you. Decent position this for United to find themselves in, but quick thinking defensively. Oliver McBurney. And the decision offside here. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Fifteen minutes left for play. Mount. Juan Bisaka. Now will the cross work out for them? Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Ben Brereson. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Now just the tackle that was needed. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can he finish them off? Well, he probably should have done, but couldn't take advantage of the chance. Well, that's a wasteful finish. I just hope he won't be regretting that come the end of the game. <laughs> Gustavo Hammer. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving, because it's still close. Oh, he looks threatening. Well, did the job in the end, to be fair. Well, what an atmosphere we've got inside this stadium. The fans are driving the players on here. Surely they're going to hang on now. He's in here. To be and huge credit to the goalkeeper they're not out of this and could that save just inspire them they need to get the ball forward quickly here struggling to get it away oh what a very fine stop to keep them in this well it's a good save but time is running out for them here half-hearted clearance Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure a victory. And nodding it just over. Well, once he gets his head on it, that's a chance, I think. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of their performance, all told? Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends. They probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end.
Well, a highly significant role played by Bruno Fernandes. Sensational performance on all levels. Stuart, interested to know what you made of his production. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round.